Hello and welcome to Gen 4. The time is finally here. We are Gen 4 Racing this season on iRacing. It's going to look a lot like the Arca car because we are still in the Arca car body. But I assure you, we're going to be hitting about 200 miles an hour. So. I mean, you'll see it here while we do qualifying. Not sure. I was kind of debating whether to do qualifying or not. Because you'll see where the number 19 is an absurd number of people signing up to this. Because everybody has been dying for some Gen 4 racing on iRacing since basically the uh, sim was created. And uh, we basically have it here. I mean, <laughs> we are uh, still in the Arca car essentially. But we've got the right motor. And we'll see what we can do. Obviously, I'm still learning how to drive this thing. As with uh, a lot of people, still trying to figure this thing out. Take some concentration for sure. Make it 3 1 and 2, alright, though. Seeming like bottom line might be the way to go. Still lots of just speculation at this point. So that has seemed to work the best for me. We're gonna hit about our all-time optimal, so that's cool. That's an uh, that's a best time. So I guess we'll push it a little bit harder here, see if we can get anything else out of this thing. Got an even better one and two there. Alright, so far so good. Got to use a fair amount of brakes at Homestead. Which is just the coolest. Alright, that was an even better lap by a decent bit. We're in the twos. Heck yeah. So, did a little bit of practice. Just the 30 minutes, as always, and being a, uh, technically, I guess, a new car. Never know exactly uh, how this is going to go. But something I do believe is that this car could get very loose on throttle by the time this one's over. So we're going to have to be careful. It's a decently long race, too. <laughs> JP saying we meet again. We just did ARCA. And so uh, I'll wish him good luck as well. So we got a long, a long enough race. Yeah, we've picked up some speed. Uh, let's go ahead and take a look. See, by the end of the straightaway, we're hitting about almost 190. So that's just, it's super cool. You're getting loose on throttle, and you'll see it even after just a couple of laps there. Even right now on the right sides. But you'll even see, like, the temperatures pretty even as well. I think you will wear out that right front if you push as hard as I did there. But something to watch out for is the left rear because I believe that's going to wear a decent bit, and that's going to give you a really loose race car feeling. And you'll see the temps here, despite being both 99, the temps are hotter on the left rear. And that's where it's really going to get loose on you on throttle. So, I'm going to try to ease onto it. Um, we've got a long race of 80 laps, so we might even have to pit for some fuel. Although I do expect uh, there to be some cautions, because guys are not going to be used to how much power this thing has. Definitely could have guys breaking loose or not gripping it up as much as they're hoping it will. And that could uh, cause, some, cause some issues. <laughs> 
But uh, we are getting ready to get started here. Very exciting. I believe this is not top split. We had over 500 people. I think I mentioned that already. Sign up for this. We are not even the top split. And I, I can tell because the number one car is 5.3. Just a little bit above us as the 19. So we could be second split or even third split with how many people signed up. This is bringing people back to iRacing. I know John Theodore specifically. I think he's coming back for it to check out the gen 4 Let's see if we got the volume we do got our settings all correct i'm actually going to move the brakes back even further you're going to want that rotation on entry because even if it's going to get loose we don't want to kill the right front either because then you're just going to be tight on entry and loose on exit and that's even worse so yeah, take a look at this here. We've got 80 laps, 45.4 estimated laps. So we definitely will need some fuel. We could end up having to do a green flag pit stop, which knucklehead me over here did not practice because I was busy trying to figure out how to not to loop this thing. So might be trouble if I have to figure out how to get onto pit road, but I figure I'll take somewhat similar to my ARCA entry just slow it down a little bit earlier, right? A good bit earlier, probably. And just focus on getting on, uh, onto pit road safely. And uh, similarly, getting off pit road safely. Because you can't smash the throttle like you can. No tire limit. Great, the series is safe. Hmm. I don't like that. Wish they'd give us like three sets of tires or something. I think they meant We're in 2007 to. now. We got all the money for the tire. Interesting. Um, I thought for sure. when they didn't have it in the game. They uh, put three sets of tires as the tires. I thought I saw that somewhere, but maybe not. Maybe it's unloaded. So we'll be uh, we taking tires when we can, I suppose. One to go. Next time by, you're on the outside. This Will time. somebody close. spin the tires on the start? And will we have calamity right off the beginning? I'm glad we qualified P8. A pretty solid qualifying effort in such a strong field. Hopefully get in front of as many people as possible, just in case we get uh, uh, Garrett Kite, hello. A messy, a messy start. Oh my god. Can we fucking go? Off to a cracking start here, gentlemen. I don't know what happened. Let's talk about something that's going on. So, Garrett Kite is wrecked off pit road. Oh. Huh? Oh. <laughs> Someone didn't even make it to the... Start apparently. So look how oh, far. Gonna be great, isn't it? Look, look how far back we are from the pace car. It's happening. Uh, they're very far behind still. Okay. Pace car ready. is off. Be ready. Green, green, green. green. Caution! Yellow flag. <laughs> they want you in single file. <laughs> I knew that was going to happen. <laughs> well, nothing I could have done there. The 17 started centered out right in front of me. So right behind it. That was going to happen 10 times out of 10. We are off to a legendary start here in Homestead. I wish I could say I was surprised. Thank you. Didn't, didn't somebody say not, uh, uh don't spin the tire? This is going to take a while. Well, uh, I made quite a, an evasive maneuver, dodging the to the left. Turn up, that happened. I don't know. Dude, dude right in front of me just mashed it. Open. Are open. <laughs> I don't know if that's, uh, awesome. that was the best thing we could do it, but... I had no practice, and I'm going to learn the track under yellow right now. <sighs> follow you <laughs> we gain a spot it's like a track walker I guess I don't think I have any damage 
Yeah, give me five fifty back so we can drive. Nah, I forget that. Should be about right. Ah, oh, JP was in it. That we sucks. Need lawnmowers. You know, we gotta have two hundred horsepower. How how can you go flat footed? So we've got people not really quite ready more than two horsepower. for this not to be an Arca car anymore. He's generous, man. One fifty. I barely held on to that thing, trying to dodge sliding cars. Uh, fifth car is in four. Or not? I don't actually know where it is. It's gonna be interesting to. Uh, that is uh, undeniably, undeniably false. false. Look back on that. Why the hell do I have to let it by? You know, I really enjoy having a clean air that morning. I think we might have the uh, glitch because no, we crashed so no, early. Some people just beat you on our for real. The field is a mess, it looks like. Shout out to the Volkswagen Jetta in front of me. Shout out to the person that got it off the arms from him. Great template. So uh, are we going to know how to catch up to the pace car, or are we not going to figure that one out either? I have no idea what's nah, going on. we're going to spin as soon as you try to pass it. So we're going to get a wave around here, or we just do it? I don't know. This is the first session. I think we're all, we're all learning. Get wave around. Yeah, the Gen 4 car, you actually have to hit all F4 in order to get your lap back. Kind of crazy. So those guys should get the wave around if this glitch is performing as it usually does. Um, they'll get to the back of the field. Looks like we thankfully did not have to let the pace go by. So we don't have to worry about the wave around. Because a lot of us hadn't crossed the line when the yellow came out. Oh, I forgot about that point. Yeah, it sounds like some guys are familiar with it, and they're just now remembering. Not pure talent. Well, Hope uh, other guys' races are going road, well. I think more than twelve cars entered this race. Unfortunately, we didn't get Gavin or Nick in here. Yeah, no, a lot of there. There was one guy who didn't get rolling on pit road, so a lot of us were way behind doing a Kyle Busch restart. So we didn't hit the line yet. <laughs> this is about as messy as it's possible yeah, to have started. The best part of that restart was coming to get the green and suddenly popped up and said, let the 15 go, 10 seconds back. Yeah, that was me. I felt that on the pit. So we should be on the inside. We'll be following the 25 yeah, up there, so I think. I'm sorry, Gary. You'll watch all those uh, guys get the wave around up there. Go, guys. They gotta hurry. There's a lot of people that have to go around. We gotta get up to the pace car. This should be single file. Single. I agree. This should be single file if we want to do Gen 4. That would make sense to me. Even having cautions in a in a, what looks like at least an ARCA race is kind of crazy. Outside of a league race. So lots of uh, lots of things look familiar and lots of things look quite different as well. Oh, that. Not distracting me. Number first gear restart, guys. Not on the tires. First gear restart. Reverse gear restart. Here we go. Can't see the leader. So why would I? I would like to race this new car. Come on! We're off to a great start here, guys. Oh, that was you. Guys, we're... Alright, dude, I'm, I'm gonna... Even though I like you, I'm gonna block anybody who jumps the start by 40 miles an hour. Come on. We got people jumping the start. Are you kidding me? 
thought we were going, but I guess. Well, we lose a spot from that, so we'll be on the outside if now. If I lose you, I probably wouldn't have blocked it, but my immediate reaction when I saw that was block whoever it is. I think everybody needs to put the ability control on. I like that. I, I get it. I don't. Like, that's why I lifted, like... I think we need traction control and stability control and racing line. I think some people need to go back to Arca. I will. I'm gonna keep running Arca. Arca's fun. I remember in NR I couldn't figure out why I was a little bit slower through the corners than everyone else. And somebody figured out it's because I had traction and stability control. And what so, have? we've got, uh... What did you say, yourself? Sorry. Another Sorry. quick caution. Sorry. Haven't really done any laps what yet. Was last? And we are 10% way of our way through this race. Probably 2010. We're not bad. Keep the phone off pit road, I guess. So, if we can potentially, uh, not have people jumping starts, not people spinning out... Plastic pedals, um, red buttons... I had that same wheel. Still have an action. I was a little too gentle, maybe, on the restart. It looks Dude, like I was like, zooming so past me. Because I had such a nice turn to it, but it, it kind of started breaking, so I switched to a G27 and I huh. hated it. But uh, I don't want to be the guy self spinning immediately, and yeah, we do have quite a bit of time to go time. still. I didn't ever use it for high racing, but I had it for, uh, what was it, NASCAR 2, I think? We've got some lap cars mixed in, they'll yeah, probably be sent to the back, I imagine. I played joystick for like a week or two when I joined NR when I was 10. Did three years with the Momo, and then I switched to G27 when I did my racing. And Usually these races, uh, if they're going to just be wreck fests before we can even race, they just turn yeah, into podcasts, I 10, as you can hear. Original, like, NASCAR racing, the first one. Yeah. I wasn't even on an airplane joystick. I had, if you remember those little, like, gray ones that had the button on the top, I had one of the... So, I'm going to need to focus. Sorry to interrupt the podcast, but <laughs> i got to think about how I'm going to restart here. Because I think I have to get on it a little bit harder than I did. But uh, it still is unstable. I'm not going to overdo it, but I don't want to get run over from behind either. It would be lovely if we could actually do some racing, though. I imagine this can't be too uncommon. Other splits are probably having very similar issues just to uh, getting these cars started. It's gonna be rough until uh, people are used to how much oomph these things have. But uh, hey, at least we're doing pretty well on saving tires at this point, I hope. Although I did slide around a little bit dodging that first wreck. Take the higher line. Still there, hold your line. Stay high. Clear. Car inside. Get a good run off. Clear inside. 35.2. D7. Inside. Just this lap for Martinez. 34.2. Keep high. Keep high. Ooh, this is uh, already pretty close racing. I want to wrap the bottom, that's the line I want. But we're actually getting some laps in, feels good. Gotta remember to be somewhat easy on the throttle on exit. 
Might have had someone in the wall up there. Ooh, I think we had someone kind of pull up in front of someone's run. That could get dangerous. You've just done a 53.7. I got loose on exit. Okay, got to be easier than that then. Because I don't want to be sliding around. There's no reason for it, and it's only going to hurt my tires. I got to get out of the Arca habits. Not in an ARCA car anymore. Can't be doing that. We are P7 right now. I'm very, very content. Running here. Guy up by the wall right now. Running up there. Seems like you have more options. It seems like uh, it's definitely viable running a little higher. Definitely wants to push out towards the wall with this extra speed momentum. Got to be careful of that. Going to try to get a bit of a run here in middle. And it'll work. I'm going to put our nose down here. Still there, hold your line. Stay low, do the car on the high side. Clear. I didn't quite keep alongside him, though. That's okay. Long way to go still. Got 0.4 behind us and then 1.3 behind them. So we do have some distance. I like that. Do we run higher line? I'll give it a try. New car, so gotta be willing to experiment a little, right? I'm gonna get a huge run. Is it enough, though? Not quite. Bit of a cut down line? What's that got for us? Not too much. Session last lap. They uh, are side by side up there, almost even three wide it looks like, at least from here. Oh man, this requires some serious driving. I love it. Oh, don't hit the apron. Can't get away with that. That definitely ruined my exit. Alright, hold it together. Still got space around us, so let's just try to hit some consistent laps. Be good to the car. Kind of steer on exit, fight off that looseness. They're fighting close up there. You see they're right on each other's quarter panels. Thankfully, I don't think we have any damage. We're doing fine even if we do. I'm getting some taps from that first incident.
Easy now, easy now. I'm gonna run higher. I feel like I'm losing touch with these guys. I feel like it's, that's a talent issue, but I at least want to try some new things. I think that's definitely faster right now, at least the way I run it. Yeah, that's looking quicker. So we'll we'll run higher line, see how it works for us. Get on the brakes pretty good. And allow the power of the car to bring us back up to speed. Be interesting to see how people fall off. Lots of unknowns right now. Not looking good for me though, it's looking like I'm falling off. That one might be a bad idea. But it is fun. And there's value in that. <laughs> it's the fun value. That doesn't show up on your I reading results page. Oh, someone maybe drifting up into the wall. Got kind of close up there. Yeah, I think the bottom line's better. Well, you see, it just, it, you get it all back on exit right there, so it's really tough to say. I think I've got to be willing to drive it a little bit more. Okay, we got a second both in front and, and, and behind. We've found our little pocket here, apparently. At least for now. Trying to maybe use the seam mid-corner to get some rotation. Not a great exit, though. We come in about lap 50, maybe? Can we even make it to lap 50? Interesting. The gap behind is now not I don't know what line I'm taking here. Slow line, I guess. But that was a nowhere line. I just didn't have a good plan heading into that corner, and it did nothing for me. You've just done a I was getting tight. Which means I was, I've been bad to the right front. So what? how do I adjust from this? Stop overdriving it maybe? That would probably be a good idea about 20 laps ago. I think I'm going to try high line 1, 2, low line 3, 4. See how that works out. And that was definitely better that time in one and two. I guess we'll try that. I'm just watching them get smaller in the distance in front of me, though. Let me see if Highline 3 and 4 is any good. Let's see, I think low line worked better. That line was at 
I like that I, uh, it's not immediately obvious, though. That means you do have options. You can try different things out, and it might be reasonable. At least that's the way it seems right now. That was much slower that time, though. I don't know what to do. They got three wide up ahead, though, by the way. That's worth keeping an eye on. Also, they're getting really darn close to that wall. Uh-oh. Okay, they saved it. That was quite a save. Got 29 behind us. I think he was the guy trying to jump a start earlier. Watch up! Watch out for his ideas. Might have some good ones for us. They are really fighting up there. I'm driving hard and see how that works out for me. That was pretty fast, actually. I'll try it again here. Kind of like a slider line. That's working. It's killing the right front, but <laughs> it's already dead. Can't kill it's already dead. I just need to drive in harder, apparently, if I want some speed right now. I'm gonna lose speed later, but maybe I'll have some speed right now. Okay, okay. This is fun. That's a fun line to drive. Didn't work quite as well in 3 and 4 that time. time was Getting like a 4 tire slide. I am killing this car. I think. And it's like, what are you doing to me? <laughs> Maybe that now that we got some space again, I'd take a more reasonable line? I don't know. This is kind of fast, though. Whatever I'm doing here. Okay, we'll drive it a little less hard, maybe balance it a little bit. Whew, tough racing, that's for sure. Even just driving on my own. Starting to catch up to the guys ahead now with this uh, crazy drive-in hard line. <laughs> this is so fun. There's a reason we've been wanting this for a long time. This is so fun. This is great. Go back to the high line. See what that's uh, doing right now. Guy in the wall ahead. Just a tick. I think he's okay though. I'm 
Really driving down into that white line. Getting on his inside, but of course he's beating us on exit. Try middle line here, see what happens. Not much to speak of. Didn't really work. 24 is coming up on us, he's lapped down or more. Yeah, don't put it in the wall. Don't slide it. Got behind me. I don't know if that was aerodynamic or if I just saw him and freaked out, but... Holy cow, I did not expect him to take that line. All right, so we got someone coming by us. That's fine. We'll gather it together. We had a couple interesting laps there. getting loose up ahead watch out oh my goodness that was very scary oh my god I'm not sure where the seven thinks he's going oh my gosh he stuck it down there that was fine Ooh, 11 okay we figured it out we're fine I think the seven's kind of taking that low line like I've been, driving in hard. We might have more tire left to do it better though. Probably come in about lap 50. Inside. Still there, hold your line. Still there at the bottom. Clear. Head up right in front of us, that's okay. Inside, clear inside. Not really thrilled about a lap car putting it on my inside, but he should be able to get back quick, I think. Five laps of fuel, so we can't even make it to 50. But I'm gonna take it till this thing's empty, I think. Because we had all those caution laps at the start. guy had fresh tires. If I had known that, I wouldn't have taken the low line, but left him a lane. We got more. There's so many lap cars around us, I didn't realize that was a guy that had pit recently. Oh my gosh, that is a mess waiting to happen, though. There's like three wide up there, maybe four. Another guy on fresh tires coming by. He's putting his nose where it doesn't belong. Oh my gosh. Looks like he was going to. Holy smokes, this is scary. The leader pit. Okay. 
I have them muted. I didn't even realize. Pitting in this lap. Still there. I'm pitting. Still there. Hold your line. You've got about pitting. two laps of fuel. Outside is clear. Okay, good entry. I'm pitting. I can't believe we actually got green flag pit stops the way that this thing started. Have you ever? No, I've never. This is the last lap of fuel. Two, one. How's this thing break? Right here. Just like the Arctic car. <laughs> Why would it be any different? 52, 58, 82 on the left rear. Okay. Good info. Good info. Put that fuel in there. Why don't you? Move it. Move it. The lead is bidding now. I'm like the last, or I'm the middle line. Don't want to be side by side exiting the pit lane, so we'll let him go ahead. Okay. All right, back on to the track. We've got some slower guys to get around. There's going to be a fair number of them pitting right here. Gotta watch out for that. Right. We gotta go again. Maybe do a little bit better job this time. Saving. Yeah, hit the hit the apron. Great idea. Car outside. Still there, hold the line. Hitting outside. All right, let's see if I can back it down a little bit, protect uh, the right front a little, a little bit more. We got some very different laps, tires in front of us. Oh, only two lap difference it looks like. Don't know if I did a good job at that green flag pit stop. I felt like I hit it all right. Get around this ten. Clear outside. Thank you. All right, thirty to go. Use that power to get it on his inside, and that feels good. It feels like racing. We're doing race car things now. Gotta be gradual on the throttle. Keep hitting that stupid apron. I'm gonna knock that off. I'm gonna go a little higher this time, get a run on the guy ahead because he has older tires. Inside. Keep high. Still there at the bottom. You're up the top three. Cool, wide. three wide. Just what I want to hear. Be able to get them both. Alright, thought you got clear. Clear inside. Inside. You're up top three wide. You see that. Just gonna constantly be three wide, I guess. Okay. Hold your line. Right side, two wide, clear. Car inside. Oh my goodness. This is crazy I'm racing. Keep high. Trying to keep it steady if we're going to be racing this close. Uh, I can't make a move with that. I have to lift. That's annoying. Clear. 
bit of a crossover. Jugs in hard. He's trying to turn himself on my nose. We're good though. E13 right now. That makes me worry I didn't have a good stop. But we still could have some evening out to do. Oh, like this 11 slamming on the brakes on entry. This guy is going to block me. I mean, not literally try to block me, but he's in my way really bad. Still there. I take it back. I think all the crew are on the car, so, you know, I'll have to uncheck my fuel box. This is tough. This is very tough. And I don't think I ran seven gallons in the pet and left. All right, just checking fuel. We're good on fuel. Can I finally pass this guy? He's been getting in my way. And he's inside. Mountain Park off Diving hard. Stay low. There is a car on the high side. It's fighting really hard. Keep low. Clear outside if you want to. And we finally overtake him. Looks like it. Alright. He was a tough pass. Ryan Newman over here. Alright, we got it done. Man, once everybody kind of got the hang of it, we've been green. I just jinxed it, but still, long, good, good long run. Look at this huge cluster in front of us, that's wild. Oh my gosh, I thought the 11 was in the wall. He might have been a little bit. They're three wide. Car inside. Clear inside. You're up top, three wide. Still there. That was dangerous. Still there. Inside, two wide. I'm gonna rip the top. Hell yeah. We just passed a couple guys, I think. Doing that. Need this 11 not to hit the wall. I said not. Holy smokes. Okay, we have survived. I can't believe we're surviving. There's been some seriously dangerous situations we've crawled through. I think we're P11 now. They were just getting stacked up on that bottom side of the track so much. I felt like I uh, had a better shot going up high and it worked. Got a bit of a single file line ahead of us now. I'm getting sideways. That was really bad. Oh, that's going to kill our run all the way down the straightaway. Oh my gosh. 
And that driver washed. <sighs> what a run. Well, Whew, we are P11. We're going to get fresh tires. Whoever caused that one, I want a written apology. Giamani. Ah, that guy that was really slow in front of us. What? Oh, maybe not. I thought he was getting blamed. You got loot. I don't know what you're talking about. I was no one here anyway. He's getting framed. It was a Shane Huffman car in the Casey Mears car. 16 had nothing to do with it. I don't know. Whoever was outside of me, they just got loose and turned down into me. Then hooked me. Caught up. It's fine, you got loads. That's terrible. Terrible. Terrible raid. Are you kidding me? This is awesome. I wanted to see how that played out. I was ripping it right here. Yeah, I was flying, even though I have two minutes of freaking damage from the start. We don't have any damage, I just realized. Which I, thought. I was worried I we did from that damage. start, but we didn't when we came in for Green Flag Pit Stop either. We're done. Get going. We took Stop two. spinning the tires. That someone took two. Show yourself. Line up, single Eleven line. Line. Not, not a great stop for me. I didn't get going very well. Thanks, Viva. You might have some alternate strategies. I want to try where I wasn't making it in 89. Scariest part now is we have to do another restart. Oh, no, I'm burning close to me here. Let's go to the Nine six nine six. That's not really helpful because I don't know whenever he came into the pits. <laughs> so we'll see where we are. See, like the t guy that was in twenty second up there he must have taken right sides only or something. Did you just get loose there, Ryan? Or I was twelfth. Okay. It's gonna be a bit of a sprint to the end now. That'll be close to the end. I was gaining a little bit, but I think I left the traffic to you a little bit. I just hope we survive. This has been really fun. I was kind of taking it easy on the tires, and I knew I had that space. I mean, I wasn't going too, too hard at it. Hey, Marcus, I'm sorry for turning you, but I, I didn't expect you to pull up there. I left hands hurting from just ripping it so hard and holding it so steady while it's loose. Comes to turn one, turn three, I've watched up so hard. At least we have avoided being in uh, any of the incidents here. Yeah. So far. I don't know, I was gonna probably do that too, just make a that lap dash like final time. It's alright. Ryan, I can't believe you did that. And just for that I'm gonna wreck you this next restart. Well, it's going to be back. I think I'm going to get a hot I'm going to get a tire saving. And I got burned Man. 25. Hi, Bird. Got to be really careful on that throttle. It's still going to pull really hey. hard to the left or right or wherever. One left yeah, I thought I would do what I was doing in the start, but I forgot that I hate this track and don't know what I'm doing, and I've been slow, so, uh... Advice appreciated. So, 12th out of, uh, I think there's 30 people in here. Not so bad, especially as the 19. But we gotta finish it off. Girl, excuse me. We're gonna have 13 to go. Like Going green. Hope guys don't get too dumb. We are having really good racing before. Dangerous, tight racing, but. Anybody know? There was a, a lack of wrecking going on, which is nice. Like reading, kind of jittery. Uh, as far as stuck and trickling and when I'm on it. Probably just compressed air. That's what I use for mine for most of my breeding issues. Alright, hopefully we can see the leader. Get ready, that one green. Pace carries off. Alright, boys, water up. 
I had to not have a great start. But he figured it out. So we're good. Easy now, easy now. I'm saying that a lot. Oh, come on, man. Dang. Well, we'll be inside line this time. I wasn't trying to put you in the wall. Right? I was just trying to stay off the roof. Inside of me, it's real tight. I'm so mad at this new car's land. Here, it's locked to us, driver. Man, six, when you hit the wall right there and I stopped between you, you got a stop truck coming to my right rear when you come off the wall. I will look at the so we'll do another restart. We're getting close to green white chicken territory, but we're not quite there yet. I'm honestly not sure. I'll look at it. Good job, but step at the right. Join Discord. I'll be okay. I'm going to show you what I'm dealing with. It's awful. I don't know if I want the inside or the outside. It's hard to even say. The restarts are tough too, because you're already going so fast by the time you get to turns one and two. Unless these things are so strong. And be really careful about how hard you're taking that corner. It pulls to the left too when you enter, when you get on entry. A couple of times I've almost felt like it, I got pulled into the guy on my inside. Pass up 11 is a Closed. Pit road is closed. Right Crap on me, guys. I lost talent. Wow, that stinks. Guy must have had a mistake. I mean, that's the three car in a 5k straight the field. Making a mistake. He's probably got just over like 5,000 high rating. These things are tough, man. This is a challenge. Especially for people like me that have never driven a car like this. Having joined iRacing like for real in 2020, passed to uh, already passed yeah, the era of the COTs, cars of tomorrow. Bit, I came down a tiny bit, and there was a little bit of net head, so uh, I, I, might have been a little bit lower on me because I had to walk first, but it wasn't really on either of us. So I'm uh, I'm used to the lower powered stuff of modern NASCAR. The only thing I've ever driven that's kind of like this. Could probably be the uh, Silver Crown. That can get a little bit loose on throttle, depending on where you're at. And obviously that's going to drive much differently than a stock car. But we're going to get one to green here. We'll line up on the inside. One left to green. You'll be lining up on the hopefully survive another restart, and hopefully it'll be the last one. We could wrap up our first ever Gen 4 race. And one of the first ever Gen 4 races. Third split. No, 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 no. We just got confirmed. Third, yeah. Crazy. I'm normally top split and everything, and I fell all the way to third <laughs> in this. Which, to be fair, I, that would also happen sometimes, I'm sure, if I did NIS and everything, but I don't do very many of those. I have a smudge in my glasses and it's bothering me, but I can't really fix it right now. And I know if I try, it's going to make it worse. So, uh, I need a tear off. <laughs> Brandon, I'm assuming you mean 5300, not just 53? Yes, sir. I mean, I think just 53 would be a little bit more impressive, honestly. Alright. Try this again. Wasn't a restart wreck last time, at least. Maybe we're done with those. Post car is off. Time to do your job. Green flag. Green flag. Green flag. Our sponsor is 
think there might have been some issues behind. Okay, though. Turn the wheel a little bit more, because that guy looked like he was pinching me. Scared me a little bit. I had a lot of trouble through the first couple corners there. That was not great. Guy getting loose down low, that's a little scary. Not much room to be doing that. I'm having fun. Outside. Go low. Whoa, second place getting loose up there. Getting passed. That outside lane might might have come in. What do we got up here? Oh, they're touching. It's drifting up a little bit. That's a little scary. Oh, what a handful this is. I was going to go high line, but then the guy ahead kind of went middle. I swear they're going to wreck up there. It feels like a matter of time. Car outside. Still there, hold your line. Clear high. Push, push, push. We can catch this car. Car inside. And behind, hold me tight, spinning. Is that going to bring out a caution? Guy on the wall. Guy sliding everywhere. Eleven's all over the place. We're driving in hard. We get around the 11 and actually gets the vice by the 8. Interestingly enough. Gonna leave a lane up top for the 11. Driving him really hard down to the bottom. I with the bird. Come here, boy. Inside, clear inside, car inside. Still there. Put inside. it in the wall. Get tight. Stay high. White flag. One more left to go. Clear inside. Last lap. That lap time was 33.9. Car inside. Not want the grip. Still there. I hope he doesn't make a hail mary on me. Still inside. Clear inside. Car inside. Still there at the bottom. Still there. Hold your line. Shoot, he got me. Oh, man. What a race. <laughs> what a race. P12. I'll take it. Good race. Good win. I'm so happy right now. This is great. Good race, gentlemen. It was fun time.
Yeah, that was a lot of fun. Good racing, guys. <laughs> fun stuff, man. Good race, man. Go back to that with you. You were part of the other one. All right, 93, 93 on the rights at the yep. end. 97, 97 on the lefts. Yeah, we definitely right. were hard on the right sides late run, but not right, much yeah, time. Exactly. Sucks we got the 4X from that start, even, especially uh -huh. since I don't think I actually got into it. Go 14 the gets the win now after getting on pole. You. He's all about Gen 4, I see. So 12th out of 30. 12th is the 19. Definitely happy with that run. Good stuff. Gen 4 is here. All right, let's see uh, the incidents. Take a look at what happened. Very happy it settled down after the first uh, couple of troubles. Oh, I, I hit the 9, didn't I? I mean, I had to get around him. There's not much I can do about that. Obviously, he tried not to. Yeah, I mean, I, I don't know. I had to avoid the 17, and I barely even did that. Is there something I could have done differently? I don't think so. That's cl cutting it about as close as I can, and I mean, I'm trying to hit the brakes. I've also got the two right on my rear end. He's going to run into me. If I don't do that, so I don't know. Not even quite sure what happened with the 17. Because that didn't quite look like what I thought it was going to look like. Oh, that was JP. Huh. I guess he was getting tire spin, and then the guy behind him just doesn't lift for him. Runs right in the back of him. Hmm. It's hard to tell, because it looks like he's keeping it straight. But I do think he was, like, spinning it up, or maybe shifting issues? Maybe a little late on the shift? We'll take a look at his... Yeah, that's that's weird. I guess it must have just been tire spin, and he, he kept it straight, but the guy behind him just uh, was moving a bit faster. I guess that's what that was. So thankfully I'm able to get around it just barely. Really, that wasn't nearly as uh, bad as I thought. That sucks. It was JP, though. I knew he left early. I thought he just got caught up in it, though. I didn't realize he was the guy that got run into. That's an interesting one. Oh, I see. Okay, this was when we were coming to the restart. These wave around guys trying to catch up. Just gets run into from behind. Just because of how weird that start was. That's unfortunate. That's caused by that glitch. I hope they fix that one day. That glitch that happens when you get an immediate caution. Sixteen drifts up into the four, but they keep it moving in the right direction. Just in time to go about three wide. Twenty-nine turns down into the six, trying to make a move. You see, he just uh, doesn't want to get caught behind uh, the slower car, and he just doesn't quite care if there's people there. I guess four with a, quite a save, three wide. That always works, right? Sure, it does, especially if you're blinking. Corner entries work if you're blinking too. Mm, okay, that's uh, an unfortunate circumstance. So we had that three having another really loose exit, I think, and it's it really, you know, see he's drifting it on exit. The five already has a run on the six, and he definitely didn't expect the six, I imagine, to have to check up. He probably doesn't even see that happening in front of him, so whenever he checks up on a straightaway, he's not ready for it. 
So that's just a bad circumstance, I think, right there. Three really having trouble on the exits. Hmm. So let's see. Obviously the 22 decided he wasn't going to lift for the 20. Let's see if it was a bit of a late call to, to drift up. I mean, it looks like initially the 20 is going to take the bottom lane. So the 22 probably sees that and he's bright. He's thinking, all right, I'll go. And then all of a sudden the 20 is like, nah, this is my lane. But uh, the 22 was uh, committed to holding his foot down, I think. He was committed and uh, chose not to lift. To be fair, it was a bit of a late maneuver by the 20. It still probably didn't need to happen. Green flag pit stops. Oh, they had an adventure right there. That was really close. I do wonder uh, what it would have looked like if we went green to the end after this. I'd probably finish right about the same spot, to be honest. Maybe a little better, maybe not. The 11's all over the place. The one's just gonna run him over. That wasn't necessary. That, he had days to react to that. Obviously the 11's really struggling. But what are you gonna bump draft in the in the Arca body? No. Like this is still the Arca body. I know it's we're Gen 4 racing here, but that's still the Arca body. That's still not gonna happen. Bump drafting. But maybe that's exactly what the one wanted. He, he's gonna get around the eleven, I guess. Twelve doing nothing, I guess. These might be tires wearing out, potentially. We're late into a run at this point. So we'll keep moving on. Such close racing. Very difficult. It's John Theodore, he uh, got damage at, on the one start. Ends up back in 20th. Not sure if he had damage or anything. All right, we're going to skip ahead a little bit. Here we got fast guys catching uh, guys on older tires. One's coming in for a pit stop from the lead. Close it down. I wonder what our caution was that ended the long run during the green flag pit cycle. 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 Green Flag Disciple. Eleven loose into the wall. He's okay though. We're still good. Eighteen. He's maybe still out, I think. Has he been saving fuel? Because he's in the lead. Guy's exiting pit road. Don't know why we're seeing some of this stuff in the incidents. I keep thinking we're going to see something, but... Uh, okay, 12 is off the wall a little bit too far, and I think I remember him saying, yeah, that was probably my fault. So, yeah, he's just a little too far off the wall, I think. Maybe getting loose, and that's contributing to why he's not fading out quite as far, but the one's expecting him to be up here. He wasn't, so they get into each other. And that was your caution. So that's too bad. Moving along the back green. Uh oh. Ah, oh, yikes. So it looks like the six got into the wall up here. Right there. 27, trying to cut down below him. And uh, just barely was not clear enough. Just gets his quarter panel, sends him into the wall, and I'm not seeing a wreck yet. 
So we still got more to see. And it's the three. Wow, the three really had a tough race. He's still driving the Arca car because he's getting loose on throttle. <laughs> and uh, wow, it just breaks on him. And then now uh, the nine is just in a very unfortunate spot and he gets just sent up in the air. These guys are trying to slow down and can't quite get there. Wow. Nearly did a somersault. So that gets a couple guys. Still could have been bigger, considering, you know, how many cars were still coming. Generally some pretty good avoidance by guys in that one. This we saw behind us because he was trying to pass us. So the one's coming up. I protect the high line. And then he's going to try to do a cut down, but he gets on the throttle a little bit too hard, I think, and it breaks on him. And suddenly he is sideways. Pancakes the wall. And uh, just exits out. So at least that didn't cause a caution. We're on the white flag now. 16, turning down. 20 wasn't on the bottom. That could have been bad. That could have hooked him, but they're okay. The two that's trying to get around my outside. He really, really was trying. I didn't even notice. And uh, we just get barely beat to the line. Look how close that finish was. He did a great job. You know, props to 11. He earned the spot fair and square. He got it done. You can see I clear him right here. I choose to go high. I figure I can get the run off and maybe hold him off just by running high. Kind of overdid it a little bit there, though. But I do stay alongside. I get that run. You get to the uh, corner. Clear him just enough. Running that high line. But he just, he does it perfectly. He gets on that seam. Doesn't not, not quite enough to clear me. He gets a little bit loose. And the runoff I had just wasn't quite enough. Very, very good. Good racing. So, good job to him. He, he earned that spot. He uh, did it cleanly. And uh, we miss out on 11th by exactly 100th. No, 1. 0.011. <laughs> Not exactly 100th but pretty darn close. So I will definitely take that. We moved back, but I did uh, have a bit of a sparkling qualifying, I guess. Uh, hit my best time. Just managed to pull that out of my hat. So makes sense that I wasn't quite able to do that consistently over the whole race, necessarily. So I'm definitely still happy with P12 as the 19. I think that's a, a good result, and we'll get 26 or so I rating from it, estimated. And uh, most importantly, we have a Gen 4 car to race now, and it's awesome. And that was a great race. Uh, once we got, once we figured out restarts, it got it got pretty good. So, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Uh, I certainly did, and uh, we'll certainly be seeing a lot more of this racing for a long time. I hope. But for now, that'll do it. Appreciate you, and I hope you have a good one. I will see you next time.